shooting in broad daylight. Tonight, new information on a story we first told you about live at 5. A woman claims her car was hit by gunfire, leading to a crash in the capital city. Iowa News reporter Madeline Wright has the new details from the Providence Mobile Newsroom. I spoke with the victim's father near his home in northwest Rhode Island. He didn't want to go on camera, but tells me his daughter is shaken up. It was right outside this door in Providence where police say a shooting triggered a car crash and some frightening moments for a 23-year-old woman. Somebody could have got really uh, injured or killed. Police say the woman was driving north on Broad Street around 1.45 Monday afternoon when someone she didn't know shot her car, causing her to hit two parked vehicles on Portland Street. It was a direct shot at the, the windshield. That was, a, that was for sure. Luckily, the woman and her passenger were not hurt. She looked like she was all right, just a little shaken. I see her crying. She was crying and stuff like that. The victim's family, who declined to go on camera, tells me she was in Providence to get some CDs at a store. You know, a neighbor that you already know. So, I mean, I, I wouldn't be in an old neighbor that I don't know. The victim's father tells me after this incident, the woman doesn't want to go back to Providence again. Police are now looking for suspects and investigating any possible motive. A lot of people do stupid stuff. Witnesses I talked to say they didn't catch whether the suspect was on foot or in a car. If you have any idea on the shooter's identity, police want you to give them a call. With the Providence Mobile Newsroom, Madeline Wright, Eyewitness News.